they're off. Global perspective is very fast. Sees the gray flashing sharp early speed too and battling it out for the early lead. So Seize the Great takes the lead, Lambo now second. Devil's Playground is just a length and a half off them. Now dropping back to the fifth spot, passed by both Dornuck and Private Desire is racing in between in a little bit of a tight spot. It's a gap of four to the next flight, headed by Drum Roll Please. Inside, skip the line. Then Global Perspective, now nine off the pace with less than a half mile to go. Divine Empire and Holton at the back, 22 and just under three-fifths of a second as they round the far turn. And it sees the gray and Lambo, who have been duking it out on the front end. Devil's Playground, three deep at the rail. Dornuck is firing a good shot, coming after the top pair. And in between those two, Private Desire. And from the back of the field, Holton trying to wind up, has a dozen to make up at the top of the stretch where Sees the Gray is the leader, opens up a two-length advantage. Lambo on the outside is in second. At the rail, here's Drumroll, please, who has surfaced from well out of it, trying to get a piece. Private Desire on the outside and Global Perspective. Sees the Gray. Sees the Gray for Hall of Famer D. Wayne Lucas. Wins convincingly. Dornuck in a photo with a hard-charging Global Perspective in 117-4. Number two, Seas the Gray was first. Four, Darnock second. It's a photo for third. Third, number nine, Global Perspective. And fourth, five, Private Desire. Two, four, nine, five on the board. yesterday and now you're winning for a legend and hall of famer in Dwayne lucas you are smiling here to you um last night i couldn't sleep just thinking i was going to ride for Dwayne lucas and the seal um when i just start knowing about this business yeah. this sport um that's the year that when i um authentic won the derby and that marked my my memories you know yeah and when I saw yesterday the silk in my locker, I was like, what? Oh my God, let's go. <laughs> Thanks God, we, we, we made it. My racehorse, exactly. They were, they were fired up in the paddock. I'm sure they're even more fired up now. But Jamie, talk a little bit about Seize the Gray. He was so much more professional this time around and broke so well. Yeah, um, um, as soon as they opened the gate, he was very determined to go to the lead. I just helped him a little bit. He took the lead, I tried to make him relax, and at the turn, he felt so good, and I was thinking, low, just let go, come on, let's get it, let's go to the wire. That's, me there. that's one thing you're brilliant at. You definitely don't take anything away from a horse. Enjoy this win, Jamie. Thank you very much. Oh, you're good, Club. Oh, guys, we just lost those.
in the winner's circle is Seize the Gray, a two-year-old gray coat by Arrogate out of Smart Shopping. Owned by my racehorse stable, trained by the living legend, Hall of Famer D. Wayne Lucas, and ridden to victory by Jamie Torres. Seize the Gray was bred in Kentucky by Jam Limited. Running time, 117.95 seconds.